Hi, my name is Eileen and this is my testimony. My life before Christ, I struggled with my identity. I didn't know who I was. I was very insecure. People that I hung out with, um, you know, I looked at their lifestyle and I thought that's who I was. So I ended up coming into the lifestyle of homosexuality. Living that lifestyle of homosexuality, it opened a lot of doors. It opened a lot of doors of um, drug use and um, just hanging around with crowds that I knew weren't healthy for me. It did bring a lot of hurt and depression. It caused me to go through a lot of these mental states where I couldn't control my emotions when something would go wrong. I didn't believe that a man could ever love me. When I would look at myself in the mirror, that lie would just, just tell me that no man can ever love you, look at you. So I continued to believe that lie. That just led me to just self-destruction. There was a point of time where I just couldn't handle it anymore and I had to cry out to God and, and just ask Him for help. And God is so good, He helped me and He led me to reach out to my sister for help. She helped me and she led me to the women's home. It was a struggle for me because there was a lot of things that I wasn't ready to let go of. And when you're not ready to let go of things, it it won't work, and it didn't work for me. I was in and out of the home for about eight times, and what brought me out was every time I was either wanting to get high, thinking I needed to get a job, or just worrying about responsibilities that I thought was important other than fixing my life. You know, I was in the same cycles, and so I reached out one, one last time to my leaders. There was really nothing else they could do other than send me to Oregon. When God sent me to Oregon, He just began to chip away those those old things, those things that don't belong there. And He showed me who I was in Him. He showed me that I was beautiful and I was wonderfully made in His image. So not only did God show me who I am in Christ, but He has done it unexpected in my life. And He has blessed me with a handsome, God-fearing man and a beautiful stepdaughter and my own baby on the way.